Hey guys, welcome back to another video with InfoSecPath. In today's video, what we're going to be talking about is a service called Yandex. Yandex DNS is a service that you can use to block some sites if you want to have certain sites blocked. So in today's video, what we're going to do is block adult content sites. I've gotten some requests from some users and I guess some parents saying certain sites are being accessed from their home that they don't want their kids or young teens to access and they were asking me if there's a way to prevent that and there is and it's a very easy process i want to show you how to do it changing some dns settings you don't have to do anything with your firewall your routers anything like that you can do this right in your operating system windows 10 windows 8.1 and so on and so forth linux boxes just point your dns server and make it make it happen so if you're ready for the video let's get into it thanks guys all right guys so this is my windows 10 box that we're going to be utilizing for this process so the first things first what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and open up our command prompt and with that we're going to go ahead and check out dns settings okay so with this open, we can do an IP config, oops, config space slash all, I can type. So here we can see our DNS service pointing to 208.67.222.222, and our secondary is 220. These are my DNS servers that are in my router at the moment. Obviously, with these DNS servers, you're able to get out to the internet, any sites, there's nothing blocked. I don't have anything blocked on my network at the very moment. So, so if you get a call or if you want to do this for, for your users at home, like right now, there's a lot of kids working from home, um, excuse me, uh, at school at home. So, you know, from high school kids to middle school kids and their parents or guardians don't want them to go onto certain adult content sites. And that's, you know, I actually got three messages on my social media platforms asking about this and they were saying they were contacting people that there were people saying that you have to do a lot of stuff in their routers and doing all this craziness which is if you're not a networking guy if you're not a security person you're not it's like speaking chinese right so if obviously if you don't understand chinese so in this case we're going to do this very simple we're going to do a test before and after and we're going to go on just playboy.com it's obviously it's an adult site but it's not like a naughty, naughty site. So don't worry. So let's go ahead and let's go to Google Chrome. I'm gonna go there first. And let's just go to Playboy, right there, boom. Okay, and I tested it, make sure there's no craziness. So this is the site, there's nothing, no no craziness going on. I'm gonna go ahead and close it, okay? <clears throat> Excuse me. So you know we can get to the site now, right? So the second thing is, what we're gonna do is change the DNS settings from this 208.67.222.222 to a new DNS settings pointing at Yandex DNS. All right, so let's go ahead and just type in network. And I wanna go ahead and go to Ethernet settings. And I wanna go ahead and change adapter options. So I'm gonna X out of here. So this is my, my, my NIC. This is a virtual machine, uh, FYI. So this is a virtual NIC that resides in VirtualBox. And we go to details here, we can see those two DNS servers here. We can close that. We can go to properties. We can go to IPv4. And right down here, we see the DNS settings. We have it obtained automatically, which is obtaining that information from my router. And so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna statically assign my DNS servers to point to Yandex DNS so we can block playboy.com. All right, or any kind of, um, naughty sites, adult content sites. Um, so I wanna go ahead and put these DNS server in. I wanna put this on, I wanna open up a notepad and I wanna put these DNS servers here. I wanna actually, let's go ahead and edit the uh, file, no, format, fonts. And I wanna put very big lettering so we can, we can see it. And now I'll bold it so now we can see. All right, so DNS one. DNS one is going to be 
77.88.8.7 and then DNS2 is going to be 77.88.8.3. So these are going to be the DNS servers that we're going to put into our local area network NIC to block the naughty sites. All right, so let's do that. 77.88.8.7 and then 77.88.8.3. Okay, and then you can validate settings upon exit. All right, so there you go. Exit, we'll wait till it um, finishes up and then we have internet. We can check here. We see the two DNS servers here. We can close this, we can close this, we can minimize this for now. And in our command prompt, you know, this is all optional. I like to verify my work. So I'm just gonna go up our IP, IP config space slash all to make sure. As you can see, we can make this bigger. We have our two new DNS servers and we still have the same IP address. 1 into 1 to see that 99.10, 99.10, and but it's just a DNS service change. All right, so for the big test, let's go ahead and minimize this. Let's go back to Google Chrome and let's go ahead and go to playboy.com. There you go. This site is not reachable now. We can refresh it, we can do everything. We can try to get to it from Edge as well to see, oh, you know, maybe we can uh, bypass it by going onto a different browser, playboy.com. It should fail as well. You cannot, you're not gonna be able to access it now. So that's pretty much how you're gonna go ahead and block any content that you don't want your kids to see on a home network. It's a very simple process like you've seen. If you have any questions or any problems doing this process, shoot me a, you know, a comment below, hit me up on social media. I'm more than happy to troubleshoot with you and help you out. So. But before we go, let's revert the changes so we can make sure it was working before, not working now, and then working after. Okay, so let's go back to our NIC settings. Very simple. Go to properties, IPv4, and let's go ahead and obtain this automatically. And then I think I canceled that. Let me see. Yeah, I canceled it. So let's go back in here. Let's hit here. Obtain, okay and we should get the new DNS settings from my router. Now, if we refresh this, we should be able to get to it here. Uh, let's X out of here, let's close it. Let's open up Google Chrome first, let's go to Playboy. Let's give this a second, and voila, we're able to get to Playboy. All right, let's go ahead and make sure we can get to it on Edge, just to make sure, Playboy. And voila, it's working. All right, so that's how you go ahead and block adult content on your local Windows boxes. If you have any questions, like I said, feel free to hit me up. Again, thank you for tuning in with InfoSecPat. Until next time, have a wonderful day. Thanks, guys.